Hi, I'm Seashore Tusar, and we are at River Park in New York City. The River Park is, it's, you know, broadly speaking, an American restaurant. I like to think of it as a New York restaurant, heavily influenced by the, the, the cultures and the things that we live here in the city. We have, you know, people from all over the world, and, we, and a lot of those people have, like, really good cuisines. I think that too often, chefs and restaurants kind of go in the direction of, uh, you know, like this restaurant, it's about me, it's about my food, it's about my vision, it's about my philosophy. And I just simply don't subscribe to that. I think the restaurant is about you and you enjoying yourself. But uh, beyond that, we're also heavily influenced by the fact that we have a farm. You know, we're bringing food that's clipped off the vine and onto the plates, you know, within hours. So in the farm right now, we have a total of about 180 different varieties of vegetables. You know, that includes maybe like 10 varieties of tomatoes, many, many different types of peppers, okra, all the herbs, all the greens, like dandelions, and Swiss chard, and mustard greens, different kinds of lettuces, arugula, amaranth, and uh, five different kinds of basil. We even have a grape vine back there, <laughs> just, just for fun. Having the farm next to the restaurant, it's a, it's a, it, it's a great advantage, but we have to obey the farm. When you're really cooking from, from what the farm is producing, you don't really have much of a choice as to like, well, what if you know, this week I don't feel like cooking eggplant? Well, guess what? The eggplant is still coming out and you're either gonna waste them or you're gonna cook them, so you better cook them. All right, let's figure out what to do with the eggplants. And you, we react to it as it comes. So one of the, the great advantages of having this farm is being able to bring people into the middle of it and have this really cool dinners. So we're hosting one of these events. Uh, it's called a, a City Farmer, Chef and a Host. And it's a great event to, uh, that benefits Just Food in the Sylvia Center. And the idea is to prepare these, these meals that really showcase uh, the collaboration between chefs and farmers. We start off with a reception where you know, everybody arrives to the farm. You, you know, spend a lot of time kind of walking around and spend some time with the farmer who can tell you a little bit about you know, what is it we're growing, how we're growing it. The, the dinner is her family style. We set a big, big table and put big platters in front of everybody and you know, people eat what they like. There's, there's something for everybody. We're going to dish with Fluke from Long Island uh, with, that showcases a few of the uh, herbs and flowers that we're growing on the farm. Uh, we're also doing a dish with squash. Summer squash are everywhere right now. And also we're doing uh, roasted prawns with, with the sauce that we're doing with a lot of the greens and herbs that are growing in the farm. It's, it's a huge uh, source of pride to, to, to see what's happening here. You know, having this crazy idea to grow vegetables in the middle of the city uh, for a restaurant and with all the difficulties that that entails. Now seeing the, the, the vegetables being harvested and being brought into the kitchen and, and actually being served and even seeing people walking by the farm the way to dinner and knowing that this is where the food comes from, it's, it's great and it makes me incredibly proud and happy that, that we've done this.